Hey guys, it's Stark. And I'm Angela Obermeyer. And welcome back to your daily video announcements. Today for lunch, we have country steak, mashed potatoes, gravy, green beans, dinner roll, fruit cocktail, cold fish graham, and carrots and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Now let's take a brief look at your sports activities week at a glance. Next, let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Here are today's top five news stories. Number one, Facebook will try to nudge teens away from harmful content. Number two, Amazon to allow employees to work remotely indefinitely. Number three, travelers at Wichita's Eisenhower Airport unhappy with Southwest cancellations. Number four, teenager attempted to steal a military Humvee worth more than $100,000 from the National Guard Armory in Hutchinson by swinging a hatchet. Number five, Nintendo says it improved its Switch controllers. Now for an announcement on senior financial aid. Now for an announcement on Powder Puff Football. Next, let's take a quick look at football student section themes. We are most excited for Guppy. Yay, Guppy. Number one. Uh, I'm most excited for getting loud on some touchdowns. I'm most excited to dress up. Cheering on our boys who practice so hard every day, and they deserve it. Hanging out with my friends. I'm excited to get loud and hype with my guys. I'm most excited to see the senior class ball out this year. I'm most excited to cheer Caden on. Let's introduce the new teacher, Mrs. Wu. I'm teaching Family Consumer Sciences. It's my class. I have Culinary Essentials, I have Culinary Arts, Human Growth and Development, and then next semester I'll teach Apparel 1 and 2, Family Studies, and Nutrition and Wellness. I'm most excited for the school year to start and to just meet my students and to build relationships with them. When I'm not teaching, um, I enjoy being outdoors, whether that's I like fishing, I like hunting, I like being with my dog, going on runs, um, and also spending time with my family. Let's join Ryan McCormick for a character guessing. Ryan McCormick, and here we're, we're doing guessing game with... Logan Harper. That's cool. All right, so there's the first guy. He's a bony man. That looks like Mr. Papyrus from the Undertale game. You are right, you are right. You are definitely right. All right, next up. Uh, Delina, probably. Don't even speak. <laughs> Don't even speak to me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm, so, I'm supposed to be the host here, buddy, but you're right. All right, now shut up for one moment. Who is this? That's Matt, the most powerful boxer in the world. We sports. You're wrong. It's Matt, the most, most powerful man in the world. He's super powerful. I will destroy you. Hello, I'm Ryan McCormick, and we're here uh, doing the character guessing game with... Drew Martinez. Alright, Drew, who is this person? I have no idea. Well, it's Ballyhoo and Big Top, which, um, they're basically the lesser-known Cappy and Mario, because they're stupid. Alright, next up is this guy. I'm gonna keep it a buck, yo. That looks like a boss from Geometry Dash. Um, I mean, you're not, I mean, I'd be cool if it was, but his name's Count Black. Whoever names their child Black, I don't know, they're weird, just like me. Alright, next up is this thing. Star from Super Mario Galaxy. I think it's Luma? It's Lu yeah, it's Luma. Let's head on over to weather. Today we'll have a high of 72 and a low of 51. Now, for a quick blast to the past, let's wrap up this day in history. Stay classy, VC. October 13th, 1792. In the District of Columbia, the cornerstone is laid for the Executive Mansion, what we now call the White House. Its first occupants, President John Adams and his wife Abigail, move in when construction is nearly complete some eight years later. 1925. I'll strive unceasingly to try to fulfill the trust and confidence that the British people have placed in me and the things in which I believe. Margaret Thatcher, Britain's first female prime minister, is born in Grantham in eastern England. 
Dubbed the Iron Lady, the conservative Thatcher dominates British politics during more than a decade in power. 1903. In Boston, the first modern World Series in Major League Baseball ends in victory for the home team. The Boston Americans shut out the Pittsburgh Pirates 3-0, clinching the series 5 games to 3. 1974. The city never has witnessed the excitement stirred by these youngsters from Liverpool. Ed Sullivan, the longtime TV variety show host, dies in New York at age 72.